Brandon, you'll agree with this. I'm sure everyone who, here who knows Joanna will agree that this phrase is fitting. It's a phrase that is actually uh, a three-word phrase in French. It's come into our language. We sometimes use it as well. It's joie de vivre. That phrase means literally the joy of life, the joy of living. And if any of you know Joanna, you know that there is this radiant joy of life that Joanna has. She just enjoys life so much. If there is a 1 a.m. Uh, trip that a group is going to be having to Insomnia Cookies in downtown Ann Arbor, Joanna will be the ringleader of that, okay? If there is a dinner that is going to be had and a concert after, she is going to be right in the middle of it. But Joanna has this kind of, uh, of just uh, a joy that just radiates. Everyone else wants to be around it. We were the same major, and he always took, uh, we had some classes together, and he always, every time, I swear I'd, I'd study extra hard for these classes, he would always end up getting a better grade than me, higher percentage points wise. So he is super intelligent as well, and that's kind of what I really admire about him, was that he kind of always set the bar super high for me. Joanna would call me all the time, and we started talking about this guy named Brandon. She'd call me many times, like 20 times a day she'd call me. Well, slowly, 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 she didn't call me as much. <laughs> and slowly, I realized, hmm, I think maybe she's talking to somebody else. see it is in that relationship that you will find what true joy looks like and not only that you will be a model an example to a too often joyless world of the remarkable joy that your Savior came to give to us <laughs>